One Piece card game set seven. We are now a zillion years into the future because we're like over a case and a half into this set. But the first case, if you watch that case opening video, was just bonkers. Me and my sensei Miguel shrippened like crazy. He opened the first dragon cards. It was like dragon, dragon. And then I opened the Luffy alt art, which I would love to see a Luffy alt art, another one. Because at this point, I think we've hit pretty much everything. Bless him. The last card we're missing is a Bonnie, I think. I haven't seen the Bonnie alt art, but everything else we've pretty much hit. So everything should be like duplicates at this point, more or less, which I'm fine with because I want to start filling out my play sets. I'm probably not going to open too many more cases. Maybe I might do one more. Maybe I'll do a live stream if you guys really want. If not, I'll just do it for fun. I do like just opening packs for fun as well. Not on camera, in secret that nobody ever sees just for thrills. Cause you know, I gotta keep it authentic. I don't want it, I don't want this to just be like an act that I'm just opening packs. Ooh, Dragon, that's the first dragon I've opened. We are just talking about Miguel and he opened this card. Yes, I need two more of these. And then I have my play set, cause this card is sick. Such a sick card. I love this texture around his body, this like spiral. Hamza, if you're listening, we gotta figure out how to do this. I think you have something somewhat similar to it, but this perspective of like coming out and making a spiral, I think we could we could use that in our catalog. Um But yeah, we the, the first case was just bonkers. You know, usually I'm opening because I wanna get a manga. And it, it drives me to keep opening. Oh, no fear, Foxy. NFF. This man is not shy. Um, but we pulled both of those so far. So I think we get, we're probably going to get a secret in this box. That's my guess. One more secret. But I also am trying to collect like SRs. Yes. Want as many of that card to pull as possible. Luffy's dad and Luffy. But. The, the Luffy definitely is my favorite alt art in this set, I gotta say. I re I do actually really like the regular art as well. If it just, if, the, if it had a better treatment, I would probably run it. I think that's it, I think that's all our hits. So right now we're at three, we need three more SRs and then that's everything cool from this box. I wonder if we'll get it before we strip them everything. Rip this one. We already got the Luffy though, so that's what I really care about. I might, I might just want to keep these sealed. I don't have that many sealed packs of this set. I've shrip them mostly everything. Five, let's see. Porsche. I'll call it at that. One, two, three, four, five. There's two more. Ah, I don't care about keeping these sealed. I'm going to shrip them. I've got an itch to shrip them. Sanji, see? Great card to pull. And there's one more. It's a Nightmare Luffy. Can we get it? Can we hit it? There's our Dawn. And is it gonna be it? Is this our alt art here? Yeah, there it is. That's Boa, not alt art, SR. All right, that was a pretty sick box. Pretty sick box. The dragon is just such a good card. I love that card. I'll put those in sleeves just to make the viewers happy. This is for you guys. For those of you that hate not seeing me put cards in sleeves, I do put them on sleeves. I just don't do it on camera because everybody likes to see the cards without the sleeves on. I think they look better. It makes you nervous, but I don't sell the cards. I'm just playing with them because they're so shiny and so much fun. All right, there we go. That's that. We got one more box here. And I'm almost done with this case. Only two more videos after this and then I'll be on break again. So that's what I do. I'm gonna strip them while sets are out. Japanese, I don't know if I'm gonna keep up with Japanese. Or I guess the next Japanese is gonna be nine. I'm definitely blessed I'm gonna do a video of nine because that set I think is gonna be not so cuckoo crazy. Yo, Bonnie, there she is. Yes. That's it. Now we've pulled every alt in the set. I have my collection. Correction, I have my collection. Very cool. All right, now we just need to pull Egghead Luffy's. That's it, that's all I wanna pull is just five cost Egghead Luffy's for days. For all the rest of the Shrippums. I want those Luffy's, the, the, the pack art, the box art. It's the best art. Dark cards I would like play sets up, but I think I'm just gonna pick them up on TCG player. I'm gonna wait for wait for these pre-release prices to chill out and then go nuts buying Luffy's. Um, but I usually strip them to get my play sets, but I don't think I'm gonna do that with this set because the other incentive is I'm trying to strip them to open like mangas and stuff and we already got it. 
There also could still potentially be a treasure rare in this box. And a manga, who knows? Who knows what is in this case? The only way to find out is to strip them. Uh, all right, Elbaf is next. Did you all know that Elbaf is Fable backwards? Double Bonnie box. What a box. I think that's three of the leaders. I think there's one leader left, right? It'd be great to get a Boa. Haven't seen Boa and haven't seen Luchi. Luchi I don't care about as much. I know my homie Miguel wants a Luchi leader, so but I'm sure he'll procure one one way or another. But I definitely would love to get Boa. Boa is really the only... Boa and Bonnie are my favorite leaders from this set. All the other leaders, I'm not so... I'm not so hype on them. I think they all look pretty, pretty mid. There's a Bonnie. Are we, are we should. Oh no! Actually, that's all the hits in the box. There's no more hits in this box. This is just how many SRs did we pull? One, two, three, four, five, six. There's a seventh. Is it an Egghead Luffy? Is it in the Blossom? Is there an Egghead Luffy in the Blossom SR? No, it's not. Is there an Egghead Luffy in this? No, it's a dragon. All right, well, that's it. Thanks for checking it out. I'm a dentist. I can't end without a dental tooth tip. If you're in the East Coast or Tri-State area, come visit me in my office. I'm on 214 North Harrison Street, and I love educating about teeth and making sure that you have healthy teeth so you don't have problems, and there's tricks to doing that. Brush twice a day, floss, and make sure you're using the right stuff because the best routine for you might not be the best routine for everybody, and I like helping figure it out with you. Thanks for coming by, and I'll see you all in the next one.